Hello everyone, and uh, welcome to another video. This is a tour of the Geek's desk. Um, I haven't done one of these since November 2011, and that was a complete fail of a video, to be honest with you. I didn't really focus on the machines, I just focused on pointless stuff. And I am, I'm, uh, I really messed up on that video. So I want to put it right, and I want to uh, make a half-decent one here at least. Um, it's changed a lot since the last time you saw uh, my desk, or at least I uh, did a tour, and um, I just thought I'd record this intro clip randomly. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys, and uh, if you do, just check out my channel. It's all related to basically PowerPC Max, uh, Max in general, really, um, and PCs, and of course, iPhones. I like what touches, because I'm I I don't want to spoil anything, but it's my birthday next month, and um, there will be a lot of change, guys. So just enjoy the video, and uh, see you next time. Bye bye. So um, I'm gonna start off with just a pan, slow pan of my desk. Uh, this is basically it, guys. It takes up about half of my bedroom, and um. It's still in development. It's not final, uh, but it, it it's getting there. It's getting there. So I'm gonna start off on my secondary desk or my media desk, as I like to call it. I usually have a keyboard there because I use this for GarageBand, and it runs GarageBand brilliantly. This Mac It's absolutely awesome. So this is, of course, this is the first Mac I unboxed on uh, my channel it's a gigahertz emac g4 uh 512 megabytes of ram 40 gig hard drive mac os 10 leopard and uh, it has recently been relegated over here um because it's a bit slow but hopefully with my birthday money with my birthday's in a month um i can get an uh another 512 for this but that that's pretty certain so hope uh, check out a ram upgrade in a month or two i have some of my cds on here at the moment most of them are downstairs don't ask me why they're downstairs uh they just are this is just some of the stuff i listen to by the way uh hang on beatles I love the Chili Peppers. Uh, Rock and Roll Soldiers. Not a very fam famous band at all, but they are awesome guys. Really, really awesome band. And uh, Nirvana, Oasis. Love Oasis as well. Love Stereophonics. You too. The list just goes on, guys. Here we have a random CPU box. Uh pencil case with a load of random stuff in it mouse uh, picture down here then we have uh, my thing where I keep all my books in uh, xbox wheel and pedals with the xbox brick by here because the xbox is by there by the way guys I'm not going to do a video on my gaming setup today but it's the um slim model 4 gig um i don't put my games on hard drive i don't know why i just like putting them in the disk drive and uh playing them they call me weird and here we have a lot of geeky stuff like a uh, awful fan that this is this was a uh side fan from from the case that was on my custom pc build it makes an awful awful racket it's absolutely terrible and it says inside there, if that will want to focus, which it obviously won't, it says, um, super fan, high quality, long life, low noise. Absolute bullshit. <laughs> uh, we have hard drives, RAM, mouse or two, Molex cables, uh, manual for the motherboard, power cables, Scarlys, all that kind of random stuff. Random stuff in here, and random stuff in here. I haven't sorted my drawers out yet. 
I'll probably stick CDs or something in there. But that is my secondary desk. I might as well show you my windowsill as well. Here's uh, trophies for my athletic club. I do cross country and uh, football. Play for a football team as well. Uh, guitar clock. Awesome thing. Random Sony battery. My garden. <laughs> uh, two camper van money boxes. Play for a rugby team as well. This is rugby trophy. One of those cool plasma balls. The only reason I'm not I don't have it plugged in is because uh I cannot find the power adapter for it. So I am on the on the lookout for buying one of them. And there's something on my brother's back there, it's one of those plastic things. Um and here is my main setter. Sweet. And I get rid of that. Look at this guys. I cannot find my tripod anywhere. So I decided, uh, with my own initiative, to make one out of Lego. It does the job, actually. It's not too bad. <laughs> but, um, I'm getting something in a month for my birthday. It has an awesome camera, so I won't be needing, I won't be buying another tripod, because this camera is, um, not going to be used anymore. Down here, going back there, and up there... We have my Apple laptop power adapter. Awesome little thing. It has a little light on the side as well when it's charging and then it goes green when it's all full up. It's pretty cool. Down here we have my custom PC build. This is a 2.8 GHz AMD Sempron 145 processor. It has 4 gigs of DDR3 1333 MHz. Um, only an 80 gig hard drive. That's another thing I'm gonna get on my birthday money. It's another hard drive for this thing because it's full to the brim at the moment. Um, I don't use it for much. I built it to, for two reasons: to run basic Windows problems and uh, just um, to build a computer. I've always wanted to build one, and uh, simple enough. In there we have uh, PSP games. My PSP is hacked, but. Um, I still do have a few games. Uh, I don't really play most of these, to be honest. Most of them are presents. Um, a couple of random PS2 games, and then back there we have like uh, PC games and software. There's like Toker, and I don't really play much uh, gaming on here because the graphics card is a pile of rubbish. Here is my cable mess coverer. <laughs> or a cork board and I don't think my cable mess is actually that bad I usually have my power uh, power book charger plugged in there and uh, I have something else plugged in there can't remember what but I don't think that's looking too bad to be honest with you guys I like to cover it up anyway just because it looks better and then in here we have uh, loads of paper shower gel and deodorant and uh, a bin my chair awesome chair got it at christmas time so comfy and uh, this is my main setup at the moment this is my 12 inch powerbook g4 867 megahertz power pc g4 of course uh 640 megabytes of ddr sd ram only a 30 gig hard drive um that's all I had the money for at the time. But it's working beautifully under Leopard. Um, hopefully, another thing out of my birthday money is to upgrade the RAM on this to its max. So stick a, a gig of RAM in the slot. So bring it up to 1.128 gigs of RAM to be exact. Then behind there we have uh, a load of random stuff. And, of course, a lava lamp. And there's the lamp. I'll show you up here as well, actually, as well. Here's the box for my PowerBook G4. Uh, it looks pretty cool up here. RoboPet, I got this ages ago. He's not used very much anymore, but he's a cool little guy. He just wanders around the floor and uh, causes havoc, basically. Here's my money box. Had him since I was, like, a couple of months old. Here's my safe. I keep all of random, like, SD cards. 
uh, and little random stuff in there. Um, pencil case, I use this for everything. Screwdrivers, pens, scissors, laptop brushy things, etc, etc. Here's my 8GB iPhone 3G in its uh, Logic 3 iStation turn to view. Awesome dock, highly recommend it. I believe they're forty pounds in HMV or any sort of place like that. It's weird because I can't actually see the the speakers on the inside in real life, but it's coming out on the camera very clearly. Here's my um, clock. I've had this for ages as well. It's kind of broken now. Look, look at that. Yeah, but as long as I can still tell the time off it, there's uh, no need to replace it. And uh, oh god. I'll just leave that there. <laughs> Notes for random stuff. I I use this so these so much. I add like a massive pile up to there, and uh, there's barely any left now. Here are my glasses. I got prescribed these a few weeks ago now, just for oops, just for on the computer. They are the cost. Pretty sweet. I barely ever wear them though, to be honest with you. Um, I keep my USB sticks in there. One of them is in my eMac, I believe, at the moment. My 8 gig Kingston. And uh, BlueTac. Here's my Hans G 18.5 inch widescreen monitor with a resolution of 1366 by 768. Awesome monitor. Uh, if you watch the unboxing, I only got this for 20 quid. Pretty awesome find. Inbuilt speakers as well. Um, random notes here, like exam scores. Uh, I got two C's, this is just off topic, but I want to share it with you guys, in my um, higher science GCSE exams in January, I got two C's, anything above a C to me is good enough, and then by here, we have a load of stuff I want to get out of my birthday money, so there's an insight, very, very quickly, um, yeah, that's about it guys. Um, on the wall we have a test drive map I always get lost on test drive it's an awesome game but the map is just massive um, GTA Vice City because I play on my PSP by here I know I know my way around Vice City like a back of my hand though slightly sad but hey ho um, random illusion piece of paper with all the GTA cars on it um, GTA 4 cheats and San Andreas cheats but that is my desk setup this will be the last one I do for a couple of months few months until I get everything all perfect and where I want it to be but um, it's coming on nicely I'm pretty pleased with it at the moment and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video guys uh, I'll see you next time bye bye